Carly, and you can hear the loud fireworks in this area, and that's what frightens these animals. But with a little love, care, and reading, volunteers spent their time today trying to calm those fears. The cubs take down their lemonade stand and they go inside. They are very tired and very hot. It's not always a celebration for everybody on the 4th of July. I know it's easy to get caught up in the fun and festivities, and there's nothing wrong with that, but there are negative impacts to that stuff too. And so if you can just be a little mindful of maybe animals that might have a hard time or people that, you know, soldiers with PTSD. That's why Kelsey spent the holiday reading to this little puppy at the Nashville Humane Association second annual calming companion event. Volunteers from Nashville are coming in and enjoying some quiet time with our pets, reading books um, and keeping them calm while the fireworks displays are going on. Becca Morris with NHA says one in three dogs will go missing in their lifetime and only three to five percent of them have microchips. They've introduced the Nose ID app to help locate missing pets. So your dog's nose is actually like a thumbprint. It's unique to them. So you scan your dog's nose and you live in this app with everybody else that's follow followed with the app as well. And your dog can get home to you faster. Back inside of the kennel. It is a hot day. Brother, sister, and honey bear play outside. Reading. Her guests arrive. They all drink lemonade. It is good. Listening to music and white noise helps bring a sense of peace to these dogs as the fireworks go off outside of these walls. I mean, it makes me feel happy because I think, you know, they won't be so anxious and they won't be so scared. So it's, you know, it's something nice for them that maybe other people wouldn't think to do. Like maybe read to your pets at home because they might be scared. July 5th is the busiest time across the country for many animal shelters because pets tend to run away from home. If you have a missing pet, please contact your local animal shelter.